I am a savage. I'm classy, I'm bougie, and I'm ratchet. <laughs> It's your girl Sid in the city and I'm back today with another haul. Yes, we're doing another haul. So as you know, it's QV Sid and I'm here today to haul black owned businesses. Yes, I am an avid, avid, avid supporter of black owned businesses and I have a lot of them that I actually support on a regular basis that I'm actually like a consumer of. So I wanted to share with you some of the products that I have purchased from different black owned businesses. Um, that I absolutely love. Some of them are beauty products, candles, clothing, accessories, things of that nature. So I want to share with you guys um, some of these products. If you've been following me for a while and you follow me on Instagram, you've probably already seen me talk about some of these products. But we're going to go into a little bit more detail and then I'm going to share with you their Instagram. So if you're interested in trying them out, you can do that. But yes, before we get into this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel, join my city. My name is Sid. Nice to meet you. I'm the mayor, the queen, the president of this city. So welcome. You're now a citizen. Yes, welcome to the city. We're awesome. We're amazing. Okay. Um, like and comment on this video and please share. Follow me on social media. I'm very active on Instagram, so check me out over there. I'm also on Twitter. I'm trying to get back on Twitter, so like guys, like send me stuff on Twitter because I be I'm not really in like the Twitterverse. Like I want to be like all the funny stuff. So like help me out if you on Twitter, follow me on Twitter, and like tell me who I need to follow so I can get a good laugh. But yes, <laughs> um, let's get into these these products. So I'm a hush and let's get into these products. Okay, okay. <laughs> so today, like I said, we're going through my favorite black-owned businesses. And I wanted to start with the my bath products that I purchased, um, my body products, excuse me. So first things first, we have an oldie but goodie. Like I said, I've talked about some of these products on my channel before, but I wanted to kind of go into more detail. So um, Souvenir Vibes is one of the brands that I was an ambassador for a little while ago and absolutely loved working with Shannon. Shout out to Shannon, she's the CEO. Um, fun story, I actually went to college with Shannon for a little bit when I was at Winston-Salem State University before I transferred to Howard. And um, we were both social work majors, so I'm super happy to support Shannon because I've actually watched her brand from the beginning until now and it's grown so much and she's doing so, 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 so well for herself with her new, with her bath and body business. So these are some of the like original OG products. She has lines of products now, guys. Like I've been meaning to purchase her Yoni products, you know, for your, your vaginal needs, your vaginal health and, you know, wealth down there. I've been wanting to try some of her Yoni products because she gets great reviews on them and I know it's one of her newer lines. So that's something I'm definitely going to check out because I love her products. So I just want to give you a little backstory on that brand. So um, the first product I want to talk about is her Canandula, Canandula facial oil. <laughs> I can never say it. Um, this was one of the products I got in her PR box and I've been using it for months like months you see how much I have in here guys I know it's scratched off because I use it so much but you see how much I have left like literally this facial oil has revived my my skin like literally I wash my face do my regular routine and I'll put this on at the end and I'll rub it into my skin and it's made my skin very vibrant it's um less breakouts I, I have a nice like glow to my skin and I have to say it's because of this oil and look how much I have left do you know how long I'm gonna have this like literally it's one of my favorite products from her from her um her skincare line so Souvenir Vibes their Calendula old facial oil is my favorite uh, and I might be saying that wrong I can never pronounce it correctly and then the name is scratched off I'm just because I use it so much. It's like literally one of my favorites. Another one of her skincare products is the French Pink Clay Mask Facial Product. So this is one of those powdered, can you see? Powdered face masks that you have to 
take a bowl and some water and mix together and then take like a brush and paint it on your face. I like this mask. It kind of, I like how it tightens my skin and like makes it very firm and just kind of clean and fresh. So I do use this every once in a while as one of my face masks and yes, another great skincare product by Sylvaner Vibes. Now please don't judge me guys. These are not, these are almost, this should be an empties video honestly because a lot of the products I'm showing you that I use are pretty empty because I use them on a regular basis. Like literally, I love these products. So I did a whole promo like video for these products right here. This is the Juicy Fruit line. Oh my gosh, guys, when I say this, I love this line so much that I was telling so many people about it, word of mouth. Like, you guys have to try this Juicy Fruit. It smells amazing. It leaves your body feeling so smooth and soft. So the Juicy Fruit Sweeter Than Berry Body Polish here. See, it's almost gone like I use it a lot and then this is the juicy fruit sweeter than berry body souffle once again another container that's almost gone um, I use this in the shower with my scrub brush and I scrub I do my body scrub and the trick with this is you have to use the body scrub is the first thing you put on your body you scrub your body to get like that first initial layer of skin and then you wash your body with your other soaps and I promise you it'll change your, your shower routine my shower routine is so long now because of the things that I use in the shower now but my skin always feels super soft and just cl like clear and just smooth because of what I do in the shower so yes I recommend using the body polish first with a scrubber or you can use your hands I have a, a body scrubber that I use and then after you shower you take you know you lotion and you put a little bit of this on your skin just to give you that nice sweet smell it's a very sweet very very sweet scent guys like if you don't like sweet scents this not this particular line may not be for you but she does have a lot of others so oh gosh there's a lint in my eye Ugh. um so definitely check out souvenir vibes guys I promise you like so many options so many different lotions and skincare products and bath products and i think she has fragrances that she sells now like oh and then she has merchandise she has t-shirts and and silk robes she just dropped some silk robes baby please check please check out my girl shannon over there souvenir vibes i will leave you guys her website link below i promise you you will love 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 her products so the next product I'm going to talk about is from another black owned business, of course. This is from Natural Raw, and my good, good, good girlfriend Ayana is the CEO of this company. And this is their Don't Be Dry Glow Crown Conditioning Spray. And so, this is my go to spray for when I have like protective styles and my hair is in braids. I told her, I remember when she was, you know, putting together her new products, and you know, she was like, Oh, you know. I think she had asked me like what is it that you look for for like you know your when you have protective styles and I said I need an oil that like penetrates my scalp because you as a lot of people know if you do protective styles your hair can get dried out your scalp can get dry and she's like okay I think I have a product that'd be good for you and she legit sent this to me for my birthday and I've been using it ever since and I love it absolutely love it it smells good you can also use it on your skin I've used this on my face a couple times only and the only reason I use it on my skin guys because I like the smell like the smell it's a very sweet but light smell I wish you guys could smell it like it's a very it's sweet but light like it's not too much it's not like a candy sweet just more like a nice scenty sweet if that makes sense like this to me juicy fruit is like a candy like this smells like you could eat it but this is more like a just naturally sweet smell and I love it so I use this when I have protective styles I spray it and I rub it on my scalp really well and then I take it in my hand rub it run it through my braids if you guys haven't seen my how I maintain my knotless braids video I'll link it for you above you guys can check that out I think I featured this this product in that video before so yes natural I'll have their website listed below she specializes and she actually does like maintain locks for people so she's a she's a, a lock spurt i'm not sure what they're called i'll call her a lock spurt because she does people's locks but she also has hair products and body products um that are natural so natural another black owned business that i love so next product is the honey pot company sensitive foaming wash um, I, I'm sure you guys, this is not a small black owned business. This is like a very well known big black owned business. If you guys are not familiar with Honey Pot, I don't know if you guys can see like the name. Um, this business is in Target, Walgreens, I think. I never seen them in Walmart, 
but I have seen them in Target a lot. They are in Walgreens. That's why I purchased my first bottle. So I have, this is the feminine wash that I use. Um, I absolutely love it. Um, I legit could tell a difference in my, my see, we're gonna get a little personal here, my, in my pH, in my lady parts. Um, after I started using this, like it's just, it's really good. And I'm using the sensitive formula because you know, just wanted to be, you know, it's a little sensitive down there. So you don't want to, I always recommend if you know that certain parts of your body are sensitive, always try the sensitive formula. So it's really good. It lasts a long time. My, this is my second bottle, by the way, this, I got this from my first bottle from Walgreens for about like $9.99. And I only tried it because I heard such good things about it. I seen the commercials about it. And then I saw the commercial where the CEO was a black woman and how she was just speaking so highly of the opportunity that she got working with Target and that she was um, basically feeling like she has uplifted other black girls to know that they can do this too. And that caught my attention when she said that. And I was like, I'm gonna check out her products. I've been wanting to try some new feminine products, you know? And I don't like, what's that other basic one that everyone uses? Um, oh, I can't think of it. I'll put it somewhere here once, once I edit this and I remember the name. But Honey Pot is the truth. Um, not only does she have different types of feminine wash, one for, you know, regular, sensitive, and I think she has one for pregnant women, which I thought was interesting. I was like, oh, they make pregnant women products, cool. But um, she has pads and tampons, I believe, and wipes, and the pads um, are supposed to help with cramps. They have some type of healing or some type of natural ingredients in them that help with cramps. And if you're like me, I suffer from really bad cramps, guys. And I've had been meaning to try them, so I might do a review on that because I've been meaning to try those out to see if they actually works. Because if they do, I'm gonna tell you guys about it. Because you know, I gotta spread the word, the word to the city, okay? So yes, Honey Pot is another black-owned business that you can find in major retailers. Um, I paid about $9.99 for my bottle at Walgreens, but I think it goes for about $10.99. Depends on the store you are. I think. It ranges between like $9.99 and like $10.99. So it's not a lot. It lasts you a long time. It is a foam. Um, you use it in the shower. You you shake it. You pump it. Clean yourself with your hands with it. And don't put it on a washcloth. Use your, use your hands. Just make sure they're clean. <laughs> and I use it, you know, every day, every other day. It depends on, you know, how much you want to use it. But yes, Honey Pot, definitely a brand I recommend for you guys to try. That is black owned, okay? Black owned. So those are my my little body products that I wanted to share with you guys. So next we have my absolute favorite, lashes. Yes, this, these are my Wink Studio lashes. I've talked about these lashes previously and I've also featured them in a lot of my Instagram posts. When I go out, I wear them all the time, honestly. Like, as you can see, like, I am a avid lash consumer from Wink Studio lashes. Right now I actually do have some on. I have on the Atlanta lashes. They come in this really, really cute packaging. Like, first of all, let me just show you the packaging. Hold on. So I have on the Atlanta lashes. These are the lashes. This, they're two. They're two. I have two pairs. So these are the lashes. They're super cute. You see how the packaging is? Like, you take it out. It looks like an old school cartoon, which I love. Like, very old school, but still cute. Very sultry. Very mysterious. It has the Instagram information and Facebook information on the side. And it tells you the, the, the details of what's in the package on this side. So one, con shout out to Imani. She is the CEO um, of this business. Her packaging, her marketing is A1. Like seriously, check out Wink Studio Lashes on Instagram and Facebook, guys. I will have their website linked below as well. I promise you like her lashes are really nice. They last a long time. Like I've had these lashes for a while. I've been able to reuse them, clean them, reuse them again. I actually do want to re-up on some. Ah, I'm dropping lashes. <laughs> but yes, I absolutely love these lashes. Um, so I think like guys, check them out, please. Like so many, I have so many. Like I like them a lot, clearly. <laughs> but yes, um, check out Wing Studio Lashes, guys. Another really, you know, dope black owned business the marketing is just flawless literally i love her i love her branding i love her packaging i love the lashes and lashes are quality lashes like literally i've had these lashes for a while and they still look good i'm able to clean them put them back on that's the good thing when you and oh 
I forgot to say, I don't know, I don't, I forgot how much they are. I think on a regular, her lashes are $18 a pair, but I've been lucky to catch them on sale and I, I buy like multiples at a time just so I can have them. So she does have sales every once in a while if $18 is too much for you, but I think it's a great investment. Um, they're really nice. They last a long time. So if you're interested in good, nice 3D mink lashes that are, you know, sold by a black woman, check out Wink Studio Lashes, okay? I have a few Instagram posts where I tag them. So go check out my Instagram and see how I looked with these lashes. It's always a good sexy. It's always a good sultry. They're very dramatic. So I just showed you guys like the Atlanta pair. These They're so used. I don't want to show you them because they, they're not giving like what they gave when I first got them because they're old. But yeah, like here's a pair. These are the, these are the, sorry. They're, and they're all um, named after cities, which I think is so cute because you know I'm a city girl. So these are the New Orleans lashes. The ones I have on the, are the Atlanta lashes. And this one comes in a different package of color. So you see, this is a different colored woman, which I love. Every, every package has a different color woman, a different shade of woman. And here are the, these are the New York lashes. So here are the New York lashes. Like I said, very dramatic, very cute packaging, A1. Like seriously guys, check them out, okay? And the next product I have are the After Five candles. So, backstory about these candles, right? My coworker, Alicia, is one of the co-founders and CEOs of this company. So Lisa and I both worked with On Peak, which was like an event accommodations company, and she joined the team a little bit after me, and so she's like my little boo, like that's my little buddy, my little mentee, I call her, um, because she's a little younger than me, but kinda, you know, we became really close, and we became friends, that's, that's legit my friend. And so during quarantine, her and her best friend from college, I believe, started a candle business, and it's doing so well. It's doing so well and I'm so proud of her and I'm so happy. And of course I had to support and buy some candles. So these are the, they're like staple candles. They have like staple lines and they have like seasonal lines. So their summer line is um, really cute, like a cocktail-y thing. Um, I didn't get any summer candles because um, I had these for so long. Like I didn't use them as much as you, you would think. So I had them for a while. Um, but I do want to get some of her new candles. I think they have some new scents coming out, but legit, the marketing once again looks great the branding looks great and that's all because of my good sis alicia because that was her major that's what she's into and she's starting grad school now doing that so i'm so proud of her but these candles are really really nice like first of all the containers this is nice like these containers see i used it i told you this should have been an empties video because all of this stuff is empty and used because i've been using them but um this candle is what's the name of this one lord the weekend I was obsessed with this one. It's, it has such a good, fresh, sweet smell. Like it's not super sweet, but it's it's like a fresh smell. Like when you're cleaning your house, you would want this candle burning because it it'll it'll just give a nice scent to the whole room. Like it's it smells like flowers. I'm getting a little bit of flowers now that I'm putting my nose in it, but it's it's a good candle. So I have the weekend, and I also had um, work bay. And Work Bay, once again, another candle that I used <laughs> to the to the bottom. I do want to re-up on these two candles, actually, because I really like them a lot. And Work Bay was more of, like, to me, a very, I don't want to say buttery, but it gives me buttery vibes. Very woodsy, kind of more of a fall scent, I would say. Like, I feel like I would, I would burn this, like, in the fall seasons, because it's almost fall. Pumpkin spice, everything nice is coming up. And... <laughs> I really think this candle would smell so good during that time. It's just, yeah, it just, I don't know, it just gives me like buttery. I don't know, that's the word I'm getting when I sniff it, but it smells really good. It also has like a sweet undertone. So those are, these are the candles. Um, here's her, their business card. I'll have them linked below. I just wanted to you guys kind of to see like some of their packaging and like here's a, how to burn them properly. So this, this is what it comes with, this card here. And it teaches you how to burn the candles properly how to um, you know keep them lasting long and yeah it's really nice and it's a thank you card on the other side it says thank you so yes these are the legit like I love these candles if you guys are looking to replace another big brand with a black owned brand that makes nice candles check out after five candles 
I promise you, you will not regret it. They also have a fragrance. Oh, I left my fragrance mist. Oh, let me go get it. I'll be right back. I want you guys to see this fragrance mist. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> so I just wanted, because I forgot I had I have other products. They have um, fragrance mist. And this one is, I believe, um, cleaning day. And I, oh, to me, it honestly smells like a, a perfume. Like you could put this on a little bit. It smells so good. I spray this when I clean, legit, I clean. I spray the corners of the room, let it, and it just smells amazing. And they have another one, I can't remember the name of it, but they have, they have two fragrance mints. So if you guys were looking for like something just to smell your house up, it has like flowers in it, you see? And it's like cleaning day, and it comes with this nice little, it's come with this nice frosted glass bottle, and it's top, like look at this packaging. Come on now, my sis did that, okay. So yes, check out After Five Candles. I think you guys would really, really like their products. Um, they're super, super cute. As you guys seen in some of my other videos, I've been burning these candles in my videos, some of my promos that I've been doing on Instagram. I promise you, you will really, really like them. So this is the end of the beauty bath and whatever products, my black owned products. We're now gonna transition into other black owned businesses I support that are like boutiques and clothing and things like that accessories so i will link all of these below for you and let's go on to the clothes okay okay <laughs> hey citizens i'm back so now we're moving on to the clothing part of this black owned business haul and there have been a lot of different black owned businesses i've been supporting that sell different merchandise so i'm going to start with the t-shirts that i've been pur I've purchased and move my way over to the other items okay so we're gonna go with this pile here first. <laughs> um, so backstory, um, throughout all of this, you know, what's been going on in the world, especially with the racial tension, um, I felt like I didn't have a lot of, I'm black and I'm proud type paraphernalia. Like I didn't have any t-shirts that said things that showed that I am a proud black woman and I'm proud to be, you know, beautiful and melanin and black and just, smart and intelligent and I decided to invest some money into black businesses that made these type of t-shirts so um, I've been seeing this one brand come on my timeline all the time and I really like this one shirt that they had so I actually went and purchased it they were having a sale I think the t-shirts were half off I'll link them below but I went to King's print King's print and I purchased this t-shirt that says melanin with like the different hues of brown skin women and this is supposed to be like a, t a tight fitting t-shirt. I haven't worn it yet, but I can't wait to wear it. I'm trying to figure out how I want to wear it. Like I haven't decided how I want to style this because when I wear it, I want it to really look super cute. Cause like melanin, come on. Like I'm definitely some, I definitely have some chocolate skin, okay? And I love talking about my chocolate skin. I love talking about being a, a beautiful chocolate woman. Like all my beautiful brown people, my queens, my kings, we're beautiful, okay? So I want to wear that on my chest boldly and proudly so this is one of the t-shirts that i purchased it just says melanin and it has those different shades of brown going down let me try to that i never worked in retail so my folding skills are trash okay um, the next shirt i got from king's print i actually wore this the other day i just washed it i'm a savage classy bougie ratchet now you know i had to get my i'm a savage t-shirt okay because meg the stallion is my girl and I absolutely like, yes, I am a savage. I'm classy, I'm bougie, and I'm ratchet. I'm a little bit of everything, and I love it. So I have my little gray. Honestly thought I got the order, the black one. And same for my King's print shirt. I thought I ordered, because it comes in black too. The melanin shirt comes in black. I thought I ordered the black one, but I got the white one, so. It's cool, I like them. I just thought I ordered black and not white, and I thought I ordered this one in black, but whatever, I probably didn't. But yes, I got the gray one. I think I'm gonna style it a little bit better. Like the other day when I wore it, I'll put a picture, or was it like a boomerang, I think I did. I'll put it up so you guys can see how, how I styled it the other day. Um, I tied it, because it was it's long. I got a medium. I keep forgetting that I'm not as big as I think I am. Like um, I be thinking I'm, like, I'm, so, I'm super big. So I always order like sizes that are not right for me. <laughs> so I could have probably got this in a small and been fine, but I got a medium. So I think I'm gonna like style it, maybe make it a crop top something cute like that you know cut the the neck make it like off the shoulder something i'm gonna i'm gonna do something with it but it's super cute they did have it in i think it came in white black and gray so if you guys are interested i will have king's prince 
social media um, here for you and their website will be listed below. So the next black owned company that I supported and got some more t-shirts, um, God is Dope, everyone knows God is Dope is the dope brand. <laughs> Um, I have my mother just actually purchased me two Goddess of t-shirts and I should have included them in this haul but I didn't grab them so um, I got some other ones to go along with the ones that my mother got me so I got this one that says I come from a praying black woman I cannot lose super cute right and I do come from praying black women because my grandma focus camera there we go uh uh did y'all see that camera wasn't focused I come from a playing a praying black woman so I definitely can't wear to wear, wait to wear this shirt it's super cute right and it's I like the way it feels it's like a good t-shirt material it's not like it doesn't feel like it's gonna be itchy it feels like very soft soft cotton so then I also got this God speaks shirt and um, on the camera it looks kind of red but honestly guys it's bright pink it's a bright pink shirt that says God speaks in white okay you can kind of tell it's pink but yeah it's really cute. I like that. I like. I love Goddess Dope. I think they have really nice merchandise. Great message. Variety of colors too. I didn't know which colors to pick. Um. So yeah. And those I got. They've been having a lot of sales. Goddess Dope has been doing like all T-shirts five dollars, all T-shirts five ninety nine, stuff like that. All like every other week. So if you guys have always wanted Goddess Dope or you wanted to get some new T-shirts, and they have other ones. I just got these. They have a lot of other ones. There was one shirt I wanted that they were sold out of. I was so sad. But I might go check when they have another sale, and hopefully they'll have that shirt um, on in stock. I can't remember what it said, but I loved what it said. Like I was, I was so mad they didn't have my size. But yes, Goddess Dope has been having a lot of sales. So if you guys want some of their merch, definitely go over there now. Because I, I can promise you they have probably $5.99 shirts going on over there right now. So next, we have um, Stunic, which is an activewear line, a luxury activewear line that my good friend Jasmine, Jasmine and I were friends in college. Fun story, she lived across the hall from me. And we previously knew each other through a mutual friend, but ever but when she became my neighbor, oh, that's when me and her became super, super close because I was always in her room bothering her. <laughs> like legit, Jasmine would come in her room and I would already be in there. Like, this is my room. So yes, my friend Jasmine started her own activewear line called Stunic, and I am one of I do I help do some promo for her um, and some paid promo. So this is from her new seamless set, the seamless line. So this is the bra. And this is black and gray. I, I got a medium in this top. And then here are the matching leggings. So the thing I like about the leggings, it's not the front, even though the front is really nice. These leggings look short, but they do stretch. It's very thick, very nice material. Um, the butt, the back gives like, it outlines your butt right there. You see it like right, right here. It outlines your butt. And when you wear them, oh, they make you look, your butt is fat. Honey, you look like you have a fat booty when you have these on. And I have a little booty, so you know, us little booty committee girls love when stuff makes our butt look fat. <laughs> so I absolutely love how this set looks on me. Um, I have it in black. She sent me this, this these sets for PR that I did for her. Um, so I have it in black and gray, and then there's a white and gray. So if you guys are like, like my roommate who loves everything white, they have a white and gray. Once again, I got the top and a medium. And I got the leggings. Here are the leggings. That good old butt design there. And they're they're very the material is great, guys. Like seriously, this material very thick. You would be you you will get a good workout. That it sucks you in. Like I said in my pre little things activewear haul, I like my leggings to like be high waisted. I like them to be tight and hold me in because that just emphasizes the the type of body curves that I'm trying to get. You know, like the little waist, the little the hips, and it just holds all my fat and makes me look skinnier than I really am. So that's why I like leggings like this. And they do they're yeah, they're really good to work out, and I have worked out in them. I actually did style the. King print t-shirt I'm um, a savage t-shirt with the white seamless leggings the other day um, as you saw in the boomerang um, and I tied it and I wore it with my little cute nude sunglasses and so this 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 activewear 
um, set is really good to dress it up. You can you can wear heels with it, you know, style it really cutely with some heels. You can dress it down with some sneakers or some sandals like I did, or you can work out in them. Um, that's what I love about suiting. A lot of their items you can are multi-purpose. They're very dress up during the day, dress up, I mean, dress, dress down during the day, dress up during the night. Um, so I will have their website link below. I actually do have a code for students, so if you guys are interested in looking for a black owned activewear to find some more workout clothes or some cute workout sets that are very, very good quality for good prices, I will have the website link below. My code will be on the screen for you and I'll have it down below as well. So you guys can get some money off your purchase. But yes, please, please, please check out Stunic. Click that link, okay? I promise you. It'll be it'll be it'll be worth your while. Literally, this is not my first time wearing her products. I have another set, but I only wanted to show you the new set cuz that one's a little older, but it is called the Orange Moon set. It's still on her website. So if you're interested in seeing the other set that I do have, Orange Moon, um I love that set too. It makes my boobs look really big though. So that set is something like I have to I I wear it in the house or only in the gym like it, the boobs speed up. I think I might have needed a bigger size in the bra, but we're not going to go there. <laughs> okay. So on to the next clothing items that I purchased. So um, my classmate from high school, her name's Amber Coleman. Shout out to Amber. She started her own online boutique during quarantine. And it's called Amber Kathy. And I absolutely love her clothing in her boutique. I've purchased a couple items and I've worn them already. And I absolutely love them because my style is very simple but sexy. Like I always, I'm always still very girly, still very sexy, but it's very like very, very classy, very just simple. Um, I don't really wear like a lot of too many bright colors. I just started putting a little bit more color in my wardrobe if you guys follow me on Instagram. But I really am like a, I like nudes, I like browns, I like grays, blacks you know whites things of that nature as you can see I have on a gray jumpsuit right now because that's like that's just the type of clothing I like to wear and that's kind of like the vibes I love her clothing it's, it's very sexy but still very, very classy at the same time so the first item that I purchased from well I'll show you the packaging so they come in this nice little it says amber Kathy on it and it comes in this little parcel super cute amber I love the packaging girl um, so the first item I ever purchased from 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 the website was a corset, and I, I forgot that. Let me let me look up the name of this corset. A court court. I, I don't know if I'm saying it right. She has like a name for it, guys. I'm trying to hook it back so you guys can see what it looks like. So I purchased this really cute corset from the boutique. Super cute, right? Um, I, I wore this a few weeks ago for a dinner gathering that I had with my friends. I'll put the pictures of what, what I looked like in, in this corset and how I styled it. But it was such a hit. Literally, my boobs looked amazing. It, it held me up. Um, you can, so on the back, you see that it's the corset part. And I had to, like, open it up to fit. I got a size small. Um, this is $40, I believe. But it's so cute. Oh. I can't wait to wear this again and like I want to style it with like a long sleeve shirt or something like make it like a fall look because I wore it in the summer now I'm excited to style it again and wear it with like a different you know vibe but it, and it's it's it has like a silky finish it's shiny very cute guys like super super cute I get kept getting compliments when I wore this um and it, it fit really well like I got a small and I'm normally my my measurements I'm like a 34 29 and a 40 those are my measurements um so yeah it fit me great I got a small so if you're like a size six and you're not too you know voluptuous like I have boobs but my boobs are not that that big I wore a small but she does have other sizes a small medium I think something like that yeah I, I know it's like a small so this is the other item I purchased from Amber Kathy this is their one of their newer items in the in the closet. Hold on, I want to tell you guys the name of this dress. Cause I'm not, I, oh, the Nina, the Nina dress. I think this is the Nina dress. Hold on, let me, let me check. Yeah, the Nia dress. Sorry, I said Nina. <laughs> the Nia dress. So it is a mesh dress. So what I did was I purchased um, a slip. I went to Target and got this really nice form-fitting 
dress slip. It fit me perfectly, it stayed on my body and I wore that, that dress slip underneath this dress. Um, you can wear it how you want. I'm just not too comfortable being that see-through. So I purchased a slip, but if you wanna wear bra and panties, you could do that. It's, it's super cute, honestly. I think this is something you can, uh, if it wasn't for this turtleneck, it could be like a nice cover up for the beach. But it's really nice. It's not as short as it looks. It actually is pretty long. It has this cute rouging, rouging on the sides and on the arms here, you see? So I'll have a picture so you guys can see how I styled it and how it looks on, on my body. But this dress is so cute, guys. Like, I know it's not giving anything right now in my hands, but you'll see the picture of how I styled, how I looked in it and it's, super cute and she has another dress that's like this but I think it's blue I'm thinking about getting that one too because it looks cute um so yes these are some some of the boutique items that I purchased from another black owned business and here's her thank you card um that comes in the mail when you order something sorry that mine looks a little beat up I've had it for a while this is like the first one I had and it has the social media on here and how you can follow them and all that information so Super cute, keep up the good work. Amber, she's been dropping new items every few months. Um, there is another bodysuit on her website that I want. It's super cute, it's orange. I should get it now because it's, it's straps, but, oh, my camera's about to die. Okay, let me change my battery and we'll be right back. Stay tuned for these messages. Okay, I'm back. My camera is about to die. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I had to go get my other battery. Thank God it was charged. So last but not least, um, the last item that I wanted to show you that's from a black owned business is, a, a, I actually just got it in the mail today. So excited that it came. Um, it's a purse that I purchased. Well, actually I didn't purchase this purse. Ugh, I lied. I did not purchase this purse. I'm doing PR for this company. It's a new business. They're an accessories um, business and they sell purses and jewelry and headbands super super cute very girly very dainty it's called a millie deluxe um they are they're based out of birmingham alabama um my friend jazz who has the active word line this is her other friend's business her name is alex shout out to alex she's the ceo another female owned business that i'm that i've shouted out here okay because black women we're, we're doing it okay we're 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 doing we're doing it okay so she sent me one of the newer one of the purses so i actually haven't opened it all the way yet i wanted to save it because i knew i was filming this video today and i was like i'm gonna just open it like fresh reaction like i've never even looked at it in person never felt it so i'm gonna open it right now so it was she had it packaged very well so alex shout out to you the packaging it took me forever to get into it but um you packaged it very well so it traveled excellent excellent it, looked, it came it came well so when i open it it has a nice thank you card on the top it says thank you and it says say hey hi sid thank you so much for helping me with the launch of a millie deluxe it is truly appreciated keep up all the hard work with sid in the city i love to see it i hope you enjoy your empire bag i cannot wait to see how you style it love lex oh and she gave me a code to use to purchase something. Oh, thank you. That was so sweet. I'm definitely going to purchase something because you have another purse on your website that I was looking at that I need to go order because I'm trying to step up my accessories game. If you guys didn't see my Shein haul, I'm trying to step up my purse game. So I got the Empire bag. The Empire bag came in multiple different colors. And of course, my basic behind picked black. But I just felt like I could style... I could wear this purse with more variety of outfits if I got the black one instead of other colors. It came in like green, mustard, pink, nude, brown, and black. I'll, I'll put the picture of all the colors that are available. So let's open up and see what the bag looks like. Okay, so the emblem was covered. Ooh, this is nice. It has that new bag smell. Mmm, I like this bag a lot, guys. This is super cute. Oh my gosh, super cute. Um, so it has the strap on top, which it's cute. I love a little cute little handheld type purse. Um, and then it has two zippers, if you can see here. It has two zippers. And in the back, it has like a card little holder. So let's open it up. Let's see what's going on in here. So here's a strap. I knew it had a strap, so... Yes, this is so cute. Very thick strap too. I wonder if I can make it longer. 
I'll have to play around with this later. Um, but yes, I'm definitely gonna wear it with the strap. I'm gonna wear it without the strap. I'm gonna wear this first. It's so cute. Great, great quality. Like this is this is nice. And it looks like I can fit a good amount of stuff in here. That's good, cause you know with Corona, you gotta carry your hand sanitizer, your mask, your wipes, everything, gloves. You just on top of what else, whatever else you was carrying in your purse before. So yes, I like this bag. I cannot wait to wear this. Oh my god, I cannot wait. I cannot wait. Cannot wait. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, I'm definitely gonna style this bag, girl, and I'm gonna take a picture and I'm gonna post it, and I'm, it's gonna be real cute, okay? But yes, Amelie Deluxe, they have other purses, they have other accessories. They are a new black-owned business. Um, please check them out. Please click on their website. I'll have it below for you, of course. Um, and it comes with a cute little um, purse bag, which is even better because these like gold, this gold, I wanna keep this like, look at the New York sign. And you guys know I live in New York. So cute, I look like a real New Yorker, walking around some New York stuff. Mm -hmm. Yes, I should get a matching hat. Is that, is that too much? Maybe that's too much. I don't know, I might get like a little black hat and I could wear it with my with my purse that says New York. Yeah, so this is the Empire bag. I got black, like I said, it came in other colors, but definitely check it out um, on her website. Super cute and it's worth its quality. Like these gold embellishments, oh, oh I'm so in love. Thank you so much, Alex. I really like it. So yes, I got this for PR, but <laughs> um, I'm going to actually get that done for her this week. So this was so cute. I'm so excited that I saved it and opened it last because I was gonna open it earlier because I was gonna be pressed and be like, ooh, let me see the bag, let me see the bag. But I was like, no, I'm gonna have it like be a genuine reaction. Let me just save it for the video. But those are all of the black owned businesses that I wanted to share in this haul with you guys. Um, all the ones that I've been supporting and that I've purchased things from in the last few months or I've been using them for a while. Like Souvenir I've been using for a while. I just started purchasing items from Amber Cathy. The t-shirts was just to add to my black, my black movement paraphernalia. You know, I wanted some, you know, stuff that was like, yeah, I'm black and I'm proud. And Stunic I've been supporting since day one because I can't put it back in the, in the bag, guys. Okay, I'll do it when I'm done talking. Okay, yes, but I hope you guys enjoyed this black owned business haul. Um, yeah, I hope you guys like, I hope I went to good enough, you know, detail with you. If there's any information that you wanna know further about some of the products I talked about, comment below, like this video, share it, join my city, subscribe. I'm the mayor, the queen, the president. I'm your girl, Sid, this is her city. I love you guys, citizens. Catch me in the city. It's been real. Bye, y'all.